Hello everybody. Today we're at the Farmer's Market in Burlington's historic and beautiful Old North Bank. I'm Theo Wilson here with uh, cameraman Simone. We're actually going to be going back and forth so this is what we know about the Farmer's Market. One thing that really stood out to me here, just walking past and introducing myself, is a sense of community that this event brings. Pretty much all of the uh, produce, goods, and food sold at this uh, farmer's market here today are local, which is one of the main appeals of coming to a smaller farmer's market. Some of the main stands here today include maple syrup, fruits and vegetables, pierogies, and a helper stand that people can exchange different forms of food. What's the name of your organization? Um, so we're here with the University of Vermont Farmer Training Program. That's pretty great. That's wonderful. Uh, why should people come to this farmer's market? Um, this market is, first off, so fun, so cute, so quaint. Um, it's also really about accessibility and affordability. Um, we all try to keep the prices low. Um, it's, in my opinion, the uh, best place to get vegetables uh, and treats in the city um, because it is the most affordable. Uh, we accept EBT, um, uh, we accept uh, other government assistant um, coupons. Um, we're right near the park, we're right near the elementary school. Um, we have fresh local organic produce um, that you can get for super cheap. Um, and there's a lot of like community around it, so a lot of like local neighborhood uh, folks come come back every week. Um, yeah, it's just a, a great place to come hang out, eat some snacks at like Miss Wiener's Donuts or um, our pierogi place that's uh, setting up er a little bit later. Um, so yeah, it's awesome. We love it here. What do you do at this stand? What I particularly sell. All right. What is your what is your favorite stand here? I like uh, the stands that have berries. Ah. And which stand has the most berries? On the front side. Uh, across the way and down there. Ah. All right. If you want berries, keep a sharp lookout for the stand. Do you know what it's called? Farmer training program. Keep an eye out for farming training programs if you like berries. What's the stand called? We are Dandelion Farm. And what does it sell? We sell fruits and vegetables. What's your favorite item? Right now it's strawberries. Do you think this stand is the best stand here? There's some good stands here, but we do a great job. Thank you. That's, that's the answer I've been wanting for though. They always say someone else, and I'm glad someone's finally mm -hmm. confident enough to pick themselves. Very good. What does your stand do? It's very good. We understand we can help with EBT food snaps or get you some tokens for the market. If you only have a card with you, we need to purchase that in some other way. And what are the hours of Hours are 3 to 6 30. What's your favorite thing about the old North End Farmers Market? Uh, the community and getting local, well, grown. I love vegetables to the neighborhood. Um, I live in the neighborhood. Um, it feels really good to, to be able to facilitate this, which I've been doing last year and this year as well. What is your least favorite stand at the event? I would never say. You'd never say? I don't have a least favorite stand. And there, everything else is so different, like pierogies. We have juice this year. Miss Wiener is amazing. Who doesn't love a Miss Wiener's donut? dislike a stand, you just can't do it. 